This problem, scientists developed a new testing device for babies. NHK World's Mitsuko Nishikawa reports. Tests for radiation exposure for infants began at a hospital in Hirata village. Over 30 families showed up for the tests. I have been so worried. I've been waiting a long time for my baby to be checked. I don't know what will happen when my baby grows up, so I'd like this checkup. Yumi Takahara lives 80 kilometers from the nuclear plant. She has long been worried about the effects of the radiation on her three daughters. Manami, the youngest, is six months old. I'd feel safer if my baby were checked at a younger age. This new device is called Baby Scan. It measures the internal radiation level of an infant placed inside it. Infants undergoing the radiation check are placed in this compartment where they remain for four minutes. The machine has a relatively wide opening and children can watch their parents during the checkup, which helps them stay relaxed. Professor Ryuho Hayano of the University of Tokyo headed the research team that developed the scanner. He says the main challenge was to make it as precise as possible. Even though the baby or the children are having eating the same amount of radioactive cesium as uh, as compared to, to parents, the, the amount of radioactive cesium accumulated in the body will be much less. In order to, uh, to quantify the, uh, the amount of radioactive cesium in the body, it doesn't make sense to measure uh, with the same detection limit as, as used for, ch for adults. The machine makes meticulous calculations and is designed to block as much external radiation as possible. It has four radiation sensors, twice as many as previous models. Takahara was anxious to hear the results of the scan. Manami was put into the machine. She cried a bit because she had to be away from her mother for several minutes. But her body was successfully measured and the examination was completed. The results came in minutes later. No cesium is detected. We have been eating a variety of foods, so that was my main concern. I am very relieved to hear this positive result. A thousand people have already made appointments to have their children examined. Thanks to this machine, those most vulnerable to radiation, infants, are finally beginning to get the protection they need.